Imagine you wake up and start to decide, I think I want to play Pets Go for the first time. You look around, you see you have no pets, and you're going to press your first roll. But what if it was a huge? So let's roll the fabled roll first. Let's see. And it's a fox. It's not a huge. What happened? There's no huge. Mm. So you roll some more and you roll some more, but you feel like there's something that you're missing. Is it your first ever upgrade? It's not the first upgrade you get. So what could feel wrong? And you have a suspicion that maybe there's something in your inventory you can't see yet. So you click to open. Exit the upgrades. And you see the big pets button. And boom! No items yet. Hmm. So instead you move over to your pets button. And you notice there is some that shouldn't belong here. It is a one in one billion exclusive huge cats. What do you mean? It means this noob has started with a huge, which is crazy. So why only have one when you can have three? So here we go, guys. We have a new with a full team of huge pets. Let's see. We have 150% luck boost. This is gonna be crazy. I as well will start a little timer and keep it hidden and see how long it's gonna take for me to get myself up into the ultimate pro status in Pets Go. I will hide the timer off screen so it's a little surprise at the end. Okay, we're gonna get started in, guys. We're gonna start rolling and our luck, of course, right now is 150 50% better, but I mainly need to unlock my other roll and all that kind of stuff because otherwise it's going to be so slow. So the biggest thing I'm going to be missing is I normally am hatching five pets in one go and now I'm only hatching one, which is such a big nerf. But I want to do it free to play, guys. I don't want to go in and spend any Robux today because that would kind of defeat the purpose. Let's be honest. And we hit our first one in 13,000 already. This luck boost is crazy. And time six unlocked. All right, so let's spend a little bit of money. We're going to get ourselves auto roll faster, auto roll. And we're going to need ourselves the hide rolls and turbo auto roll as soon as possible. Let's get ourselves a little bit lucky, golden dices. And we should be good. Oh, we're getting at times 1,000 bonus rolls. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Bada beam, bada boom. And there we go. 1 in 35k lava slime. Not bad. So one thing I want to unlock as soon as possible is going to be fishing. Fishing, of course, is going to be a double whammy. I'm going to get roll pets, get myself money. But as well, I'm going to get myself fishing coins. So I want to get this upgrade as soon as I can. From that big roll, of course, we got enough money to get ourselves auto roll turbo and hide roll. So we're good to go. Yes, well, we're going to go ahead and claim our golden dice potions that we get for free from the forever pack after buying myself a few of the luck upgrades i think these are actually the are the only ones you're gonna get you can see we're now getting 125 percent more luck but we are still getting more from our pets as well so that's how crazy having a full team of huges actually is so our goal right now is super simple we are going to rush to fishing which is around here in the bottom right so you can see we're gonna have to go through quite an expensive line of items to get even to fishing but i'm gonna go ahead and prioritize this first because i think fishing is going to be so good for the character let's make sure we're going to use all our stuff as well so we're going to use all our consumables all our potions we start off with and let's just use five golden dice potions as well let's see if we can get any luck so far from this We can claim our time 50,000 roll. Let's give it a go. 3, 2, 1, and boom. Good luck, me. Ooh, 1 in 625k as our first big boy pet. That's very nice. Holy. And with that, I think we can unlock fishing. Hopefully, better items. And fishing. Boom. There we go. So now... 
we can start earning fishing rewards and those will probably spiral me ahead through the rest of the game so here goes our first time fishing come on what's gonna be the first pull up come on little fishy come here you got this you want to join me and there we go 25 coins okay our fishing is going absolutely great i'll show you why it's so busted in a little bit like i'm almost done and i'm had to having some insane luck so far from fishing but we got our first million coins on the account so let's see what we can spend it on like i think we should still go for potions so why did i choose the tier for coins potion because i need to get my coin coins anyway i'm not gonna go for the, all the other ones because i'm gonna get these actually from fishing i don't need to unlock these because i'm just gonna get these from fishing instead so i'm gonna save all the money from spending on all these upgrades for stupid potions i don't need and instead i can use them on more luck increases like luck here or leveling instead so we're gonna use all our money for all these upgrades on here daily bonus roll farming gold all that kind of stuff and just keep making upgrades on our fishing we've been going for around one and a half hours right now in total we're gonna unlock our super chest loot and fishing has been treating us absolutely god tier. So if you scroll right down, I already did open a bunch of chests, guys. This is not everything we got so far from fishing. I've opened up a ton of them. And you'll see the spoils in just a second. But I made sure to save up some of the thingies uh, in the end. I was mainly opening actually everything besides the legendaries I got so far. Uh, but if we open up these... And you can see, like, all of these coming in, like, golden dice, etc. But we have... The legendary treasure chest. It actually will sell for 15k gems, which is pretty nice. But I just want the items. So we're going to go ahead and open up all of these bad boys. Boom. And get ourselves six more. Get 60 of these. So, of course, we get more baits. But look at this. And this is why I did not invest in any potion upgrades or anything like that because there is no purpose look at these we got blazes we got the best luck tier potions we got instant luck twos etc so i'm just gonna go ahead and spam everything that we have like oh my god this is gonna make it so much better we have all the fruits we have speed up potions like we have instant luck ones instant luck twos oh my god this is so busted and like i said this is again why i didn't use any of these like it's so good wow okay we're gonna make so much money right now as well like look at this everything is like piling in we got like instant luck twos we're gonna get like really good pets as well we're gonna get a lot of money from those. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. I'm just gonna go ahead and use every single thing that we had so far. So we're gonna go ahead and use all the luck potions, all the golden dice, everything. So we're gonna do a quick little montage and we're just gonna let everything go to zero. It's gonna be crazy. Okay, so now we're at, like, almost 6 mil coins. Oh, my God. Everything is just, like, piling up. It's so, so, so good. So, yeah, if you're a brand-new player, I would definitely recommend just literally go for fishing as soon as possible. And then just fish and max out your character. That's literally it. Like, I'm gonna continue right now. And I'll let you guys know when I have maxed out fishing. And I think that's, that's it. Okay, I think we are done. We have been going for around two hours, as you can see right here. So we're going to stop the timer and we're good for now. You can see we got ourselves almost 100,000 fishing. And boom, the last one is done. A treasure party final version has been unlocked, which means fishing is fully done. And with that, in my opinion, like how the game currently works... It is the game is done because everything I can get from this I can get from fishing and all the pets are just lucky RNG rolls and all the other upgrades don't add anything. So we're going to open up all our fishing crates at the end and we got to sell some more blazing dice. There's nothing too interesting to be on some instant luck ones. Um, but would this mean that you technically don't need any huge pets? I would say, yeah, there are pretty, pretty, pretty uses. I think, like, only if you're a person that 
is pay to winning that has like five rolls etc so you can actually roll for pets you can see all this time i've been going the only good roll i got was from claiming this roll right here all the other stuff wasn't that crazy so uh for my progression my huge pets probably made it let's just say maybe like 20 percent faster because the start of course it, it is very nice to have these huge pets for the extra little bit of luck but all the other pets we're all just very boring and basic. There wasn't anything crazy. Like I said, fishing has been the best unlock so far. And yeah, I think to be honest, this wraps it up quite nicely. So I think to be honest, this is going to wrap up my video for today. If you did enjoy it, I will highly appreciate, of course, a like down below, a subscribe to me. Let me know what do you guys think. Do you think huge pets are worth it? Are they absolutely kind of trash if you're free to play? And is fishing just the way to go? I think the answer is yes, but let me know in the comment section down below. So see you guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, that like button down below, and subscribe if you want to see you guys later today or tomorrow for another video. See you guys. Take care. Love. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. And of course, as well, take care, guys.